What up guys, coming at you guys with another video, here to talk about Adrian the Problem Broner, Virgil Ortiz Jr. And pretty much recently Ortiz uh, put this post on IG where he was pretty much like, oh I've always had respect for Broner. Uh, shout out to Broner for taking a picture with him when uh, Mike Tyson pretty much brushed him off and uh, told him nah. Uh, Ortiz in that post said that Adrian Broner invited him to take a pic. And he also mentioned, like, oh, uh, who would uh, like to see that fight? AB, uh, now retired, basically, unless he gets his $10 million. But it's looking like Oscar De La Hoya commented on that post, pretty much saying, like, oh, this is easy money for uh, Ortiz. And Adrian Broner pretty much was like, all right, like, what's good? And if I'm being honest with you, that be that's a good fight, man. That's a great fight at welterweight. Ortiz right now he's he's looking good. He's looking like a hot, well he is a hot prospect, pretty much the prospect of the year. Uh, Adrian Broner, uh, last fight was Manny Pacquiao. Got beat by Manny Pacquiao. Uh, has his last fight that he won was uh, Granados and Granados gave him a great fight. If uh, Adrian Broner wants to make $10 million bounce back, I mean, this would be like a good start. Like, Virgil Ortiz, an up-and-coming su superstar, I'm going to say it, an up-and-coming superstar in the division. Broner has been out of action for a minute, and it'll do good for both their careers, if I'm being honest with you. Look, if Ortiz can stop Broner or get a good victory off Broner, it's going to benefit him. If uh, Broner could get a victory over Ortiz, which, you know, a lot of people are thinking highly of, you know, it'll put him back uh, in the mix, in the talks. But I don't think it's going to happen hypothetically. But, I mean, I wish it did. That'd be a good fight. But realistically, I don't see it happening. Golden Boy, Adrian Broner.